Hi everyone, welcome to Star Trek Payette. Um, I just, yeah, wow. Apparently I have something to drink my day. tea tonight. Yeah. Um, so last time on Star Trek Payette, <laughs> we discovered uh, a supernova in the Shackleton Expanse that has been uh, slowly expanding for 20 some odd years, I think it was. Uh, yeah, and uh, the shockwave and it's traveling just um, uh, slower than the speed of light, so we went to investigate. Because that's pretty young for it. To, would you call it a crisp? It was a it's crisp. A crisp. It's a crisp supernova. Super yeah, fresh. Super green. Super green. Yeah. Yeah, that's right. Yeah. Green. All right. Uh, when we got there, um, we also discovered a uh, metallic object uh, close by. So uh, Sofek decided to scan it and found that it was. Um, a vessel, uh, a, 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 measure, vessel. A, a vessel, a non-nuclear vessel. A non-nuclear. Non Actually, was it was using it was nuclear. Yeah, yeah, it, was, it, was, it, was, it was a nuclear vessel. <laughs> um, in the shape of a spinning top um, that was slowly orbiting a red dwarf. I yeah. Believe. yeah. Yeah. All right. And then we discovered that we got on board. It had no power. I had to do my engineering to make it work. At least the parts that we are. And we discovered through accessing a computer system that this thing has been going at sub light speed for 18 light years, about, so it's old. And it's been through multiple ion storms and it's unshielded. And then we were told that it's got a Earth-like atmosphere and we found a jungle on board. Yep. Um, yes, a very... Dim jungle, surviving mainly on ultraviolet radiation as opposed to what you would consider natural sunlight. And it, yeah, due to the ion storms, it's hypothesized the original crew is long dead. And that most of the jungle has grown from seeds and roots in the time being since then. And is also attempting to eat our chief science or our chief uh, security officer. I was going to say, I can't believe that was the like the last thing noticed. So as we, uh, it's the last thing that happened. I'm being it judged is. by death lines. You are, yes. and, and that's where we're going to go to our trailer. <laughs> Start. the bat let us start so initiative starts with you i am going to burn i retain it yeah <laughs> all right so you retain <laughs> so yeah i just like i have my like the knife gripped in one hand and like another trying to break the chokehold from this rope uh vine my like feet are kicking i'm gonna try to cut the the hack the vine hack away um so that would be daring security. I'm gonna take another one. <laughs> Cause I don't want to die here. <laughs> so it's just like we have found your predator. <laughs> <laughs> Son of a bitch. Um. Okay. So I am cautious, and I was Those that a sixteen? That was a three. No. Thank God. You didn't whiff horribly. Don't worry. Um. Okay. So that was a three. I'm gonna use the cautious to re-roll one. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> That was one better. Um, and it's fitness security? Uh, this one, melee, is daring security. Daring, yeah. 
sure it's fitness. I'm, no, I'm pretty sure it's fitness somewhere in here. I remember reading it. It's fitness well, security. Well, the three for is Daring. two successes. That's another success. So that's three successes. Daring security. Dar really. Is it daring security? Remember, it's also a post. Okay, so then that's three successes. Three successes. Okay. Yeah. So I'm gonna. Yeah, I'm taking extra dice because I surprised you. So I, I rolled a, I rolled a burnt one off earlier. Right. Um and daring and security, right? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so I rolled a critical. Son of a. And that's just two successes. So you will. What about one? So you 14, cause 16. 14, 16. Yeah. You cause damage. You attack. With my knife. So you stab into it. The yeah. knife is uh, what wrong character sheet? Uh, two, I think, isn't it? Two plus security. Yeah. And vicious. Two plus yeah, so seven. And vicious. <laughs> it's 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 not a regular knife. <laughs> it's not a regular. It's not. Oh, it's yes, it's a knife. She pulled out. <laughs> she pulled out the uh, the, <laughs> the battle god Rambo's yeah. blade. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and also, it's being wielded by like a nine foot tall Amazonian <laughs> <Berserker> Viking. <laughs> you attacked the wrong crew member. <laughs> and it's vicious. Oh, it's vicious. So all of those Star Trek symbols are two damage. Great. Um. So threes and fours are nothing. Let's get them out of there. How many more moment? Okay, burn a momentum to reroll my damage. And reroll this one as well, because that's a four. Okay. Man. You can reroll them. You can burn a momentum to reroll your yep. damage. Yep. Yeah. To damage. Yeah. To damage. Yeah. Reroll. Uh. Ah yeah. That was just as good. No. Well, that five adds an additional two damage. All right. Mm. So we got five and two, four, six. Two, six four, six damage. All right. Six damage. There's an injury. Oh, There's an injury. Oh, yeah. We got some fire. <laughs> Burn There's this mother me. down. Terry <laughs> phasers. Yeah. We have plasma we fire. Yeah, it's okay, better. so it's you good. stab right into it's like almost like a bladder like uh, oh, like body yeah, that it's got. You said bladder like. <laughs> yeah. Um, and a whole bunch of like gooey secretions, just like oh, Vaya. Varia. Varia. Sorry, I'm Vaya. Uh, Varia. It's. All over you. You got full on. Did you see the new Ghostbusters movie? Yeah. Yeah, you got slimed yeah. like she did. Like every time she just got like, it's everywhere. Frosted like a cake. Frosted like a cake. And, and did so he. So feck, you just kind of like flick like a tiny, little tiny speck off of you. Otherwise, you weren't hit at all. Uh, Do I land? Were you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You, okay. you, were, you weren't even that far off the ground. Oh, it okay. came down to you, right? Right. But you just kind of like. Collapse in this goo uh, and gluey, like it's sticky, and like like you kind of stand up, and as you do, some of the the forced floor comes up with you. So yeah. like there's yeah. Oh good. I uh, I yes, help her up, and I go. This is why we continue to wear our suits. I step as I step by a little bit. I go. We have to maintain the crewman standard. Crewman <laughs> 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 standard. <laughs> Y'all are dicks. And I just it. like flick <laughs> like a gob on him <laughs> and take out my phaser. You do the whole dog thing. You yeah. get it everywhere. Well, Keep oh. alert. 14, 12, I, and I got my phaser 14, like pointed up. 12, point and up. 19. Oh, nice. Okay. Plants decided it's had enough and it's out of there. May I have that, please? Um, so, uh, as you start to walk, um, Sofek, you feel a prick go through your suit. Is how it from up? Because I'm looking nope, up with nope, my phasers. Nope. Okay. How do we end up on the death world? Wonder uh, jungle. It's more of like it's more of like you hear a, and and before you can like turn, you feel a stabbing on your arm, and you look in and you see a very sharp like needle. Like uh, I think cactus needle, which would cut through one of those suits because they're not designed for that kind of puncturing, right? Yeah. At least I always thought that. Am I they have been suits? cut through a lot. Spacesuits yeah. aren't really yeah. built for that, are they? Uh, they're as thick as the plot demands them to be. It cuts through. Because <laughs> I rolled two successes. Sorry, man. <laughs> um, that was a very so Star trek -y answer. Yeah. I am going to do. 
damage. We need to get out of the jungle now. Okay, so one, two, two three, three, four. What's it no, have? Four. Four. Uh, it's got lethal and debilitating. So. Um, so well, it doesn't do a crit. Uh, doesn't do. Extra you know, damage. you're fine. So if a character suffers an injury from a dart and recovers either uh, from avoiding an injury or receiving first aid in the next round at the end, um, you, wow. So if you suffer an injury and in the next round or at the end of the encounter, a second injury is immediately dealt to the target character. Ouch. <laughs> Doctor. <laughs> <laughs> Debilitating. The Mets. doctor's full on like, oh my god. Is this, this is this is like an organic I, poison similar to saponin. May I read debilitating while you yeah. do that? Debilitating. Medicine tasks to perform first aid on characters injured by this weapon or to heal injuries caused by this weapon increase in difficulty by one. Sure okay, so you're going to take the four damage. Um, yep. And uh, thank god no injury was created. Yep, yep. Missed it by uh, that much. I look back at the way. There would be no call for doctor. It'd just be me going. Yeah. <laughs> um, and you, uh, so you all hear something moving in the in the like. You're all like kind of hyper. We need to retreat. So again, don't forget. You discovered that this jungle. This is it. Yeah. This is the whole ship. Do I sense any sentience? No. Nope. Great. I so can, we're literally in a trap. I make a passing note to Sofek that this is the second time an alien has injected him. <laughs> First time didn't go well. He's now half plant, half Borg, half Vulcan. <laughs> so far, I have preferred the nanobots. <laughs> <laughs> I like the <laughs> one arm's dead. The dog okay. is just poking it. So yeah, you hear, you hear, you hear movement in um, the brush. The brush. Okay. Well, I I'll got my crazy phaser out. I'm going to step in between the group and the rustling noises. Yeah. Um, call out, we are uh, from Oasis, uh, Payet. We come w uh, without harm intended. Please yes, stop call. attacking us. Yes, yes. What? I have not sensed any sentience. That's an animal. If it is, I don't think it's going to listen. We should retreat to the uh, back to the corridor, sir. We can regroup at least. Mm -hmm. We're in the dark here. Yeah, yeah, that, that. Agreed. Go. <laughs> Everybody. Go. Why don't you make me a roll to see which way you need to go? Because don't forget, I told you there was no path. A survival check. Mm -hmm. Like. So this would be. Uh, may I? Yep. This would be presence and security. Uh, okay, so that's 13, and I get two successes. As survive, I used my survival focus. Okay, so you're fairly certain it's up. Remember, it was a steep. Oh, okay. But you actually don't remember where the door is. You just like turn around and go back the way we. Uh, I don't go outside. Yeah, no, it's um, not really. It's not really like. Don't forget, I did say it was like super thick, right? Yeah. Like it's so it's not easy to just find, and your tricorders are not working properly. Okay. Which I guess I would assume that that means our comms wouldn't work to the ship for an emergency transport. Correct. Yep. I believe it's up the hill. All right. So you well, start kind of like going well, back. Sorry. If do you, do you tell me you don't know? <laughs> like, what do you mean? Do you believe it's up the hill? I believe it's up the hill. We are in dense jungle, sir. Do you know exactly where it is? We have no lights. We well, got your headlight, and yeah. it is dim. Okay, we... It's dim light, like it's like it's like sun has just set. So you got that like. Okay. You know what I mean? Sure. Like, it was it's it was dust. really black when you first walked in because yeah. your eyes aren't used to it. But as your eyes adjusted, you realized, and you what? Do you remember why it's so dark? Well, it's basically it's just the ambient solar light. It was Ooh. just blue light. But it's, it's more on the ultraviolet. There you go. Oh uh, yeah, the ultraviolet scale. Yeah, it's on the ultraviolet spectrum. So it's more less visible, more ultraviolet, right? That's why the colors of the plants are more blue and purple, so less green. Okay. So we could try to find our way back to the door and get killed by a plant, or we could find out where that power source is and possibly get killed by a plant. It's your call, sir, but we're in the open here. I wouldn't call the I, 
I would Perfect. argue that we are not, and that is the problem. And as you say that, the bush rustles again. Uh, I, I like, point my taser down. Do, do you shoot? No, I don't shoot. Oh, okay. But I'm like, ah! And, and the if, bush if rustles moves, again, and then something rolls out. Like, ready action. I kick whatever rolls out. <laughs> <laughs> Just That's football kick. Back in there. Okay. Screw yeah. you, Elvin. So, <laughs> so the three of you, the three of you. Elvin, that's your fuck. I agree with the kick. So Do it. <laughs> I will, oh, I, mean, I will, I will pin it down. We will. Well, so no, it's as, just okay. He, so hold he, on. He makes it sound like it's just a little ball, right? No. Yeah. Well, so as the as the bush rustles again, yeah. a little tiny fur ball rolls out, and you hear. Oh. And as you do, okay, you, no, 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 you okay, kick it, fine, and you're just here. Sorry, Tribble. And yeah. you just you see this. You see this fur ball. <laughs> just go. If it's a, I give her the biggest you pat hear, on the back you ever. Like, <laughs> Of large bushes and vines, <laughs> and then you're pretty sure you hear like a snapping noise. <laughs> at this, Excellent. At this point, the I, side pan goes on. You just see the mortified looks <laughs> on everybody. The so doctors me, just, <laughs> and I'm, then it gets to Gurkhan and he's smiling. I'm smiling. <laughs> I'm loving so this. That's going on, and it gets to so effect. Doctor, I still cannot feel my arm. <laughs> <laughs> I believe it is spreading to my face. Could you, uh, <laughs> 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 Damn it! <laughs> okay, I say we move forward because I have a feeling that this power plant thing has something to do with the interference. So can get in the back. Back. As, you, as you like calm down, you kind of move the bush, and you see two other triple like looking yeah. mammalian, small mammalian creatures. Yeah, <laughs> look down. That's the other two chipmunks. <laughs> I, 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 I gotta go destroy them, Maria. <laughs> You're gone. I think you're gonna need the red paint to put another X on the pie for you to go. Look, <laughs> I'm still dripping <laughs> plant viscera, and Sofek can't feel his arm. Of course, if something comes out of the jungle, I'm going to it is do my lucky. job. It is quite lucky it did not stick to your foot because of the plant goo. Baya, really Baya is well. is finishes with your arm. And then she looks down and she's like, they're so huge. Don't touch them, please. She's already picked one. Uh, yeah. <laughs> so she's done for Why do you even me? bring me on these yes. things? I... Or do you want to roll for first aid? <laughs> Not really, but I kind of have to, don't I? Yeah. <sighs> Those look like... Oh, hey. nailed it! Yeah. You're fine. Where's the eraser? There you That's go. really good. Those look like a report So I found from... out basically first aid removes stress. Like, oh, it okay. removes all of it. All of it? But they were lethal. lethal. That only matters if you did an injury. Damn. Also, it's the difference between like an unarmed strike and like a phaser or a stun phaser. Like, right. that's Because gotcha. yeah. I was trying to figure out first aid after last time, and it's basically there's not a set stress. It's basically, oh yeah, stress is just reset at like the next scene or you get first aid. Great. In a scene. Great. It's the injuries that I was like, you're going sick day. So you're covered in goo and he's okay. <coughs> I say this day is going better than most. For so you see her scanning this thing as she's as she's talking. She's like, yeah. "This is fascinating." Why? Well, it's almost exactly like a triple, but it's not. And she kind of holds it out, and you're like, oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Why? Why, why do we even have a security officer? She says, <laughs> "Pointing <laughs> foreign objects." She says, this is, "I'm not face. eating it." It's so Jessica, weird. I'm not licking it. It's fine. I'm scanning it. I, I, I'm still wearing my gloves. I haven't touched it. I'm not going to rub up against it. Doctor. But I really want to. <laughs> Doctor, for scientific purposes, is it more or less aerodynamic than the dribble? <laughs> <laughs> I can answer that one without any further research. <laughs> she says, um, she says, it looks like this is like, it's almost like it's, 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 don't, it's almost like it's seeding the plants. Has it evolved in this ecosystem? Can we well, tell looks, that? I don't, I, it, like, it's, it's not from somewhere else. Well, it's definitely it, part of this ecosystem, but it's completely sterile. It can't reproduce? No. Isn't that the whole point of Tribble? Well, that's what I thought. So, they're seeding the plants, but they can't... Well, they're eating and seed, like, they're just here to... Like... But eat. they can't reproduce, so... Is this thing's immortal, or they just... I don't know. Well, let's... Do you have a containment unit? Let's pack them up. It could be they were simply engineered to be seed relocation animals. Fascinating. That's, yeah. There's one less now. <laughs> 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 we 
can only hope it does not irreparably damage the ecosystem. Wow. We don't know. Wow, if it's you're in. like you're really upping your like your your sarcasm <laughs> for so far. Hey. I'm really impressed. Hey, hey yes, call. what? <laughs> <laughs> That's okay. One day yes, call is just gonna really get what is it? Yeah. It's fine. He gets one. I didn't let him get <laughs> he gets, seated. Everyone gets one. <laughs> I, I like did, how he... I did let him get seated by cyborg soul. You yeah. know. Or Borg. And then when tailed by a plant. Well, that wasn't my fault. And possibly seated by the plant as well. <laughs> yeah. so we Maybe will it will grow a personality in here. I'm just going to start his walking towards that unique. sense, that, that radiation thing. Be like, what? You either come with me or just, yeah, and bring the non troubled cute. Yeah, this is so adorable. The it's one gone. on the ground is no longer there. Uh, so are you going to continue? Yeah. Okay, so as I'll you continue, point. you guys start to hear like a. <laughs> You start to hear a, a battling of water. Ooh. Yeah. Like yeah. a waterfall or like a stream. Like or a stream like... at the moment. Okay. Yeah. Um, I wonder if that's self-contained or if somehow the water system is like... So you're in space. So did they... They'd be filtering the water over <laughs> and over and over. Maybe that's what the plants were really here for in the first place. Or that is how the plants thrive. Or there was meant to be a crew, and this was going to be how they create the new planet, and now the crew's dead. Because they got ionized, or the jungle killed them? I think the ionization might have made the jungle angry. Well, yes, Gop sure did. Probably standard. Well, if you can take a shower. In or the ion storm killed crew, and the plants de developed a taste for flesh and blood. Oh. I am melodramatic, Gurkhan. I do not believe that actually happened. I also do not believe that they've eaten anybody yet. They've only injected them into you. Maybe they developed a taste for not human blood. I'm going to start scanning ahead of us because uh, the rest of my crew have decided to debate the finer points of plant injection theory. I'm 15 feet in front of you guys, sweeping. So, uh. Like with a broom? Yeah. Yes, with a broom. It's yeah, okay. well, she we made a room out of the corpses of the triples. So the triple has the stress of three Good. and no soak. So it's just... <laughs> I love that you're like, I kick it. Was, okay, I'm when gonna, you said we've that, been assaulted I'm like, twice I'm like, by this joke. When you said that, I'm like, oh, this is going to happen. Like, it's like a no-brainer. I'm pretty sure it's going to get to a tree and like, this tree is bleeding. Oh. Uh, yeah, right. <laughs> That's not the tree. But now we have a marker. Uh, <coughs> we come across the bleeding tree. All right. So as you head up, you start to get to the you get to the uh, the stream. Uh, it's fairly yes. small. Okay. Do we have to wade it, or is it more just like step over it? Uh, is it no. more like a creek? Yeah. Um, you think if we it would be like ankle height deep, knee height, or yeah. Uh, ankle high to knee high. Mm, that's dangerous. Yeah. Um, it's coming from a. Um, it's coming from a copse of a copse of uh, big flowers that look like. Um, Wait, the water's uh, coming. Look like like it's coming out of the out of the ground. Yeah. Near a copse of flowers. Mm. That look like really large sunflowers. Um, the void those. So they're like the the still the bright purple, but the central disc is like uh, large flat flat purple flower heads. Um, and the floralettes are like still that bright yellow. Uh, the stalks are probably around three meters tall. Most the base impressive. of the stalks are like thick roots. It's around a bulbous. Um, almost like a they look like they sit directly on the ground beneath the flower anyone want to take a sample or should we just keep walking towards that energy signature these are pretty interesting but I'm not a biologist well I mean so far two things have tried to kill us and we've killed one thing right. so we're not quite either one <laughs> you're going to toss a rock into the stream 
It's a stream. At least it was a rock. Just not checking. A cool. uh, is there any sign that there's been any like um, anything that lives in the stream? Like uh, how do I even explain that? Fish. Yeah, like anything like fish or swamp gator. Yeah, well, that's why. Like, I was looking for a reaction, yeah. right? Like, if if Anaconda. I threw a, a rock into the stream and yeah. like something moved. Can I have a control and command roll from everyone? Okay. <coughs> Thanks. Uh, Thirteen. Do you have real interest in those sunflowers? Yeah. I might re-roll that. <laughs> <laughs> Oof. Uh, control and what? Command. Oof, because that one is a success. But um, we had obviously the prime directive, and then our other two directives were um, contact, uh, contact new life. Yeah. Right. And yeah, explore. So yeah. Uh, the other two were. Uh, explore and map the new sector and make peaceful contact with the new civilization. I don't know if this constitutes making peaceful contact with the new civilization, but I would like to. <laughs> Here, you can have that. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to re roll that 20. <laughs> All right. Uh, I'm going to do the same thing. Yeah. And I rolled a 20. Oh my God. Victory oh. for the captain. I'm going to roll both because they're both failures. All right, two successes now for me. Okay. I got one success. Okay. One success. And a 20. I got two. Okay. Uh, you're still wearing your suit. Yes. You are mm -hmm. as well. And well, his suit's got a hole in it now. Do you have, oh, yes, yours does. I have my I visor need, on. Thank you, Paul. Mm -hmm. I have my visor on. You left your helmet on, yeah. but you and I have eyes off. <coughs> <coughs> yeah, okay. Uh, so, you got two? Yes. Okay, good. So, um... It's never good. So, the kind of like the vibe of us has been getting more sort of like tense. Um, at first, we thought it was just because of the creepy friggin' jungle that we're in. That would make sense. Um, but then even you start to get a like, uh, mm -mm. no, no, no. I should not be like tempted to be fe feared. Like you're, you're starting to, you're not losing control, um, but you are definitely feeling something is affecting your emotions or your your ability to maintain your logic. Um, you do maintain it. You rolled your successes, but. Uh, you kind of check your tricorder, and uh, the pheromones. Remember, I mentioned there was yeah elevated here, like to the point, and it's like almost like matching the same pheromones that you would Im imagine for fear. Hmm. Like I'm experiencing fear, or I want to things to fear me. No, you're experiencing. Um, yeah, and it seems to be pretty intense here. So you and Vaya are both very like Doctor. Or is it Doctor? Doctor. Yeah. 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 You and Dr. Vaya are both very like, uh, we should, we gotta go. Let's, can we, let's, I wanna, we, we gotta keep moving. We keep going. Yeah, we like, can keep moving. We need to keep, keep moving. moving. We need yes, to keep sir. moving. Yes, keep moving. I'm reading, it's a good thing we kept our helmets on. I'm reading a uh, higher concentration of pheromones that induce fear in biological creatures. Yep, yeah, that makes sense. Let's go. Captain, please put on your helmet. Look at my tricorder. Good, Vaya. <laughs> put your helmet on. <laughs> Doctor, you as well. Please don't. It just kind of looks like it's like mopey. Initiate the uh, filter system on the suit. Yeah. Where's the button? Oh wait. You think Vaya has suits glued together so it'll never be punched through now? <laughs> Crunch. Yeah. Kirkon, Crunch. do you have any sort of sealant? Duct it. Rip. Um, and as you do, uh, as you're kind of like. Checking these, you was it you that was looking at these flowers? No, I was looking at the stream. I was looking at the flowers, but I didn't go to the flowers. Okay, uh, we'll use. I'm gonna use you. Okay. Um, <laughs> as you kind of like flowers. walk by, because I said they were yeah. coming from the, from where the water starts. Right. So as you walk down through the stream, you get a little too close, and one of them just goes, and you see a gas kind of just go. Up. Like almost gas, like liquid, you yeah. Know, like um, beer spray, right? Same concept, right? Like a so it, spray. Yeah. So yeah. It, it hits your helmet, and yeah. it just kind of like <laughs> instantly vaporizes. <laughs> this jungle loves you. <laughs> I hate outside. Do you, 
Do you need a do you wipe? Oh, no. Fine. Do you wipe? Huh? You sure? Te- te- just... Technically, we're inside. We're not out. Inside of shit. So the spray is like <laughs> so thick that it's actually visible. It's a fine mist. Yeah. Um, I, we're no one is taking the off their helmets. Does the tricot tell me what it's actually like? Yeah, it's out built out of like pheromones. Um, like it's it's almost to like. It would make anyone meet paranoid and jumpy. Hmm. Um, and this plant looks like it has the ability to adapt what pheromones it would. So whatever physiology that might it might encounter come across it. This is fascinating. This entire jungle seems to be designed to kill everything in this entire jungle. <laughs> and anything else. No, no, it's not des- well, yeah, I guess it would be that. <laughs> it seems like more it's trying to protect this area. It's putting out fear pheromones and paranoia so that we would avoid this area. Clearly it's protecting something. Well, then let's find out what it is. I think. Uh, You see another one of those dark grower plants off to the side. I would recommend we avoid that plant in particular. (laughs) (laughs) Unless uh, Commander Yazagov would like to collect more samples on her suit. Yeah, we didn't even need to bring the containment unit. <sighs> Are there a bunch of these, like, dart throwing? Can I? Now that he's pointed it out, I want to look around for them. Yeah, you can see a few of them. Uh, it's a Cecil plant that bears, like, these small ones. It stem and, uh, the stem and the flower uh, can, like, almost rotate. Yeah, um, I know which TOS episode this is from. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Um, this book is this this adventure is very much homage to that episode. Yeah, yeah. it's fantastic. I love it. Uh, great episode. It great episode. Um, I wonder if I can snipe these plants from where I am. We're running out of time, so you oh, okay. Decide All right, sorry. Um, I'm going to. Uh, Don't I'm forget, gonna... you guys. You know that sh- this ship was on its way towards an ion storm, right? So, right. And now you know what will happen if you're still on the ship when it hits an ion storm. Explain right? that we'll all die. So okay. So now that he's po- he's pointed out these these plants, I'm going to try to uh, plot a, a safe distance or a safe path path, yep. path through them. Okay. Um, yeah. Yeah, and you start to be able to do that. You realize too that it might not be a horrible idea to follow alongside the path of okay. the of the stream because okay. it's the first sort of like path you have found in this jungle. Right? Okay. Um, and as you kind of like wander around, you see another few of those triples all mm-hmm. over the place. One rolls away, and then you hear this as a Venus flytrap type thing yeah. snaps up into it. Yeah. Um, but it's big enough to maybe even grab a leg. Like some of these plants okay. are pretty large. So I note that and also look for one of those. We're going to follow in uh, her footsteps. So she, <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> everybody, single file, stay in the line. Oh, make fun of yes, ago. So you hear these low whistles. Front, she gets to go out front. Um, and you hear these low whistles. <laughs> and then you hear, uh, yeah, and, and you hear the crack of bushes. Um, and, uh, give the signal to, like, crouch down. I get the feeling you're being watched. Uh, uh, so I'm going to give the signal to stop and crouch down, and hopefully they remember what those signals are and follow my lead. <laughs> We're, yeah, they're, we're not they're incompetent. Yeah. We're just buffoons. <laughs> <laughs> I imagine everybody crouches down except for Garkon, who's like... I know. I stand oh. proud in defiance of whatever's arriving I'll at us. We're take... not slow. We're just not quick. Okay, so, and then I'm going to look around for whatever it is. I'll take no, out my phaser at this point. I'm paranoid. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. You would. Yeah. So, uh, is, so is Vaya. Vaya's yeah, both like... Is. That stuff is not wearing off fast, right? Mm. So you're both like... Thank God you have training. Like your Starfleet training is really forcing you to like, uh, yeah. Mental. Um, so, so as I'm you start to like peek thing. up, yeah. uh, you lose sight of them. Like uh, as soon as you drop down, it looks like you lost sight of the lights and the sounds. I want to use my tricorder to see if I can pick something up in close range. The problem is nothing in close range. Okay. Yeah. Uh, and beyond close range, you're not getting any readings. I'm gonna s- try to sneak forward. Okay. Give me a, give me a con- control and secure, uh, secure, um, yeah, control and security. 
Um, Holy crap, is that a critical? Yeah. Yep. So that's three successes. You are the knight. Wow. I just disappear into the underbrush. That would not help my paranoia. <laughs> <laughs> Woof. Was she eating? <laughs> Phasers, widespread, widespread, <laughs> burning this place to the ground. Grakan, can you fit some sort of okay. quantum basic device to explode? So you place? see them again as you're like wandering through, and you get to that point where it's like, <laughs> I'm gonna start fucking shooting things. Like you're yeah. just, you're so on edge. Um, you know how to get back to these three, but you, you're four, right. uh, but they are not with you at the moment. Yeah. So you're on your own. Um, something tried to eat you. Yeah. You kicked a tribble. Oh. <laughs> like, you just, you're not doing yeah. hunting. I'm on high tribble. alert. Absolutely. Yeah, you're on high alert. Yeah. And you see them again, and you kind of pop up and follow with your, and you notice it's like almost like a box. And you're getting weird electromagnetic reading from it. The same reading you'd get from an automated machine. Uh, can I, um, like, uh, I don't know, triangulate my uh, position? No, my my um, tricorder to lock onto if they have like a unique signal or unique electromagnetic field or something like that. I t Let's eventually want to like so that it's tag actually it. Like hovering. Right. Yeah. I essentially want to tag it and yeah. then be able to follow where it's going. Oh, uh, you'd have to actually like physically tag it. Oh. Yeah, but okay. you can track so you can so you can yeah. program it. Yeah. So that you know what to read for next time. Right. So I'll do that and then the I'm gonna blue. sneak back to them. A whole, you saw a whole bunch of limbs in various tools and uh, was that like almost a trowel you saw on one of the limbs? Right. Um, Maintenance bots. Gardener, yeah. gardener bots. Okay, so I'm going to sneak back to them and go, I saw mechanical devices that seem to be maintaining the uh, garden. Androids? Robots. Some kind of mechanical device. Did not seem sentient, was on the track of some kind, had gardening supplies and various limbs, was basically just a box with tools. tools. Did you see where it was going? It seemed to be on a preset track. I have it, uh, I have the um, signature on my tricorder and I'll share it with uh, the rest of them. Mm -hmm. Sounds but I think you can track this thing. Also, did not seem aggressive. At least not yet. Hmm. Many things here seem to be proximity based for aggressiveness. We still need to find the power source, yes? Yes. This is why we're here. Mm -hmm. Well, um, I have my assumption would be that these robot gardeners have something to do with the power source. They would need a power source. If we follow it, we might get to where we're supposed to go. Yes. Or backtrack along the track that is just running along. Oh. Can you show us where you saw it? Yes, uh, this way. And I'll s sneak forward again just in case they're okay. aggressive. Yeah. So you sneak forward, there's nothing there. Okay. You don't see it at all. And there's no like track or anything. They were hovering, right? They were hovering, yeah. yeah. Um, it, does it look like they made a path through the jungle? No. No. The only path you see is the one you guys are leaving as you go off the, right. off the creek and into the... The uh, devices were um, hovering, so they would leave no track through the jungle. Is there a residual signature that we can pick up? Um, if you're within close range, yes, but from where you are now, no. Hmm. We should continue on to the power source. Agreed. Okay. And I'll take point. All right. So you head down towards the creek, and uh, as you continue down the creek, again you hear the like the like further on you hear uh, clacking, and you hear some you see some of the lights, and you can see something that's almost the size of a human fist. Mm -hmm. It's got a few like smaller tools peeling out from it, and seems to be hovering on the edge of grass. Very very quickly, like darts up, kind of like a hummingbird. Mm -hmm. Does a couple things with a couple plants, and then takes off. You lose track of it very quickly. This place is getting weirder and weirder. <laughs> yes. Keep moving uh, forward. You start to hear more water rushing. Ooh. Sound of a waterfall almost. Okay. And the creek is getting larger. It's smaller. Are we getting closer to the power source? Mm. Oh, okay. Yep. Um, Perhaps the power source is guarded behind that mound of rushing water. That would make a secure location for it. 
Just thinking out loud. Um, so as you uh, uh, as you uh, come out, like you push through some more bush, and you realize you're at the kind of like the edge of the Whoa. waterfall. Oh. Uh, it drops about uh, three meters. So we're at the top of it. Yep. Drops about three meters uh, uh, from the high from the rock into a pool of water at the bottom. Do you have a rope in your engineering kit? <laughs> well, what is the trickier do you have a rope? I don't know. You jury rig a lot of things. <laughs> <laughs> it's 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 not it's three meters. We can climb this without any fear of death. <sighs> Uh, you'll have the best grip of us all. Yes, I'm not so worried you're about me. Showing that this is like the energy tier. Energy isn't a tier. It looks I mean, we could always look down some lines. Right on top of the energy source, Captain. <laughs> Perhaps it's hydroelectric power. Mm. The energy output does not from match the any <laughs> any known hydroelectric power, Captain. Well, then we best find the thing. Let's, uh, who wants to climb down first? Shoddy, me. I'll do it. What? what? No. <laughs> <laughs> you seem to be getting readings from the robots. Oh, okay. Underground. Uh, it seems like there are more of these, uh, maintenance robots underground. Also, me first. <laughs> <laughs> and I'd, like, start climbing down. <laughs> Always ruining my fun. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Yeah. You, uh... Sassy. <laughs> this uh, is fascinating, says the doctor. Survive. She, she, oh, sorry. Oh, go, go ahead. Go ahead. I'm just going to use survival. Yeah. To re-roll. One of these. Two God both damn it. Can I roll, Can I roll yeah. both of them? Oh, good. Oh, my God. Oh, worse. wow. <laughs> I mean, her grip would be better because she's sticky. <laughs> Varya. If, if it's fitness and security, then I have one success. Okay. Uh, so Yazikov, you drop three meters. Great. Um, you take two damage. Okay. Two stress, sorry. Yeah. The three won't count. Yeah, I just have to. It probably eliminates two stress. <laughs> <laughs> so you're pretty sure um, so the doctor, before she falls, the doctor is really looking weird. at you going, look at this, it's fascinating. And it's you and she amazing. talk about um, the fact that this, this pool... In the water looks like it's like a, um, it's like a recycling center for the water. So it's almost like it collects and then recycles the water as part of the forest maintenance program, like it's or maintenance, like it's it's too perfect. Yeah, it's not something that would be naturally occurring. Well, it could be, growth. yeah, but I mean, or it was something that was initially designed to do this purpose and. That's time it. and overgrowth has expanded it. Yeah, but the but the recycling of the water is working. It's working really well. Like you, you notice that the. Yeah. Jessica falls. Yes, Jessica falls. <gasps> uh, I'm gonna climb down real quick to check on her. I'm fine. I can climb, sort of. <laughs> Fitness. Oh my god! If you land on no, me. No, that's two successes. Yeah, you climb down, no problem. <laughs> I'm like, you see my, you see my visor kind of come over your visor. You all right? I'm fine. <laughs> you sure? You landed the, on your back. It was the suit. <laughs> I, I mean, the right. bonus is the water has washed off all the goo. I'll help. Get yeah, well, I'm climbing. I'll help you. Nice and slow. Okay. Yeah, one success. Oh, you will slip as well. I'm, I'm, yeah. <laughs> as I help, as I come up. Thud! <laughs> oh, no, no damage. damage. I, I, I landed. <laughs> <laughs> I meant that, Captain. <laughs> I meant to do that. <laughs> Before anybody asked if I, what happened. I'm, I'm, going, to like I'm, I'm going to climb as well. I'm not, <laughs> I'm I only uh, want to use the momentum. I'm garbage. Yeah. Fitness and security, right? Yep. Yeah. yeah, I'm garbage at that. And also, my arm's still kind of numb. Yes. Num so I'm taking my time. Okay. Numb arm. Numb arm? Numb arm. That's two successes. <laughs> yeah, so even even Sofek made it. Oh, I guess I guess so Barry's so gonna go down. No, oh, she's she'll fall. No. Oh, that was. That's a three five. Five. Nothing, so No damage. So she lands it as well. Yeah. <laughs> All right. So she lands kind of next to you awkwardly. You okay? 
<laughs> I'm fine. I'm just stretching my back. I'm fine. What really happened is I actually... believe that everybody forgot when I single-handedly sliced open a vine and landed. No, because your suit, even though it's mostly watch, is still not up to swimming standard. Yeah, no, we didn't forget. I'm, I'm under the impression that her fall was... She was trying to let go of no, a handhold and no, put it. No, nothing. <laughs> <laughs> she gives you like a little nudge and a wink. <laughs> See, um, we got it. You all... How you we're doing extra burpees during Kelly's studies this week. God damn it. Mm-hmm. <laughs> okay. I'm going to have a cold then. So, <laughs> uh, would someone like to make a check as to where this energy uh, reading is coming from? Yep. Do science, science man. I will help the science man do science. Okay. <laughs> oh, the science, okay. science man. I didn't say that. Yes, God wouldn't say that. Wow, that was terrible. Well, I'm going to remove the variables mm-hmm. so you didn't see that. I did not see that 20. Where are the 16? That looks arbitrary. Oh, wait. Uh, are we doing reading science for this? Um, what am I using? Just you. Just you. You're, You're trying to find this. Yeah. Just a dumb You got 16, thank you. That's a success. Okay. There we go. Uh, <laughs> two. two successes. Okay. Yes. So you figured that the the readings, the energy focuses. So this pool is is fairly fairly large. large, not large. Remember that we were kind of zones. Yeah. Think like medium range. It's about that big across. Okay. So you have to wander around, um, and you can see that the rock is fairly solid all the way around, with lots of thick growing vines and growth around the outside of it. The water, uh, nothing comes into the water though. Like the water is the vines don't touch the water. No, no, they stop at the ground, and then it looks like they they just don't grow further than that. Weird. Is there like a doorway, a cave, and you just see a lot of? So you kind of walk along and you push your hand through some of the vines after checking to make sure none of them are the boa vines that are attacking her, and uh, your hand goes in. So where there should be rock, you keep going. So it's a hologram? Holographic? No, no, no. Like you push through the vines. So yeah. You move the vines. Like the vines there's no, no rock, rock that is like looks like everywhere else. That looks oh, like just built to look like the vines. Yeah. Hmm. So we can walk through it? No. I will walk through it. Face okay. check. Uh, you walk through, and as you do, you are Proof. standing inside of a room with a whole just bunch of computer so many darts. <laughs> so is it clear? You it's, a two meter, <laughs> it's a small room, two meters in radius, okay. contains screens and interfaces. And no immediate threats? All are active. All are standard size for about human life. Okay. I'll poke my head back out. It's clear. Mostly just computer terminals. We'll need your science, science man. Excellent. I shall alert you. There are samples to collect. <laughs> <laughs> I, like, I walk through the vines. I was just giggling myself. I love my crew. <laughs> okay, so as you walk in, um, uh, you realize that this is you two both actually can read a lot of it using your tricorders. Mm-hmm. Um, your tricorders are now able to translate rudimentary, not super complex. Yeah. Um, but you're managing to able to figure out that one monitor is kind of like. Um, dedicated to monitoring the environment of uh, most of the streams are, are monitoring the environmental conditions on the ship um, and on the forest including water content of the soil air quality um, one screen notes the existence of exceedingly high fear pheromones emitted by the one sort of flowers you saw um, and uh, you see repeated pattern there's also a direct voice interface um, yeah, and you realize that there's an actual like physical program um, that denotes more intelligence than less. <laughs> Saw this on a uh, document. Hello, computer. Hello. I did not expect a response. It's really broken. Uh, let's say thickly, heavily accented. So it's unusual for the Scottish. <laughs> hello. Hello. Because <laughs> you said hello, computer, with a Scottish accent. <laughs> hello. I believe uh, he was trying to mock me. 
horrible Russian accent he did. <laughs> Horrifying, really. Worse uh, than the fear pheromones. What? State inquiry. What are you? Why is you? No. <laughs> well, hand I we. am the Griff Balata. What's your purpose? To bury the... That's my bad. Ooh. No, I remember the name of the... Wait, wait, wait. To bury, bury the Vaharai to their new home. And what are the Vaharai? They are. They Where? are... The plants? Negative. They are... Humanoid species? Affirmative. From what planet? That is not a valid question. Jump in here anytime, crew. I'm how running many, out of thoughts. How, how many of them are on board? Uh, none. It does not say us. Yeah. <laughs> uh, what happened to them? Please repeat your inquiry. Where is your engineering bay? That is not a valid question. Where are, are your engines currently functioning? Engines are functioning at a low levels. How to improve levels of engine function? To get it faster so it doesn't blow up? Mm. Also, it would make it easier for us to tractor this thing out if mm. we need to. Mm -hmm. You notice one of the monitors is starting to... Um, change in the sense that it's gone from being kind of like standard uh, yeah. protocols to security measures are being activated. I do not believe this. You see, it, it actually, sorry, I'm sorry, sorry. Yeah. Um, it actually says alien presence is de detected in control room. Captain, I do not think this vessel's computer appreciates us being in its control room. Fair. Why do you say this? Um, as you say that, three of these walk in through the door. Yes. <laughs> I get to fight things. No, they're so TOS. I they love are it. so TOS. So you see these large robots with like the very uh, so destroy, <laughs> destroy. Yeah. Are they saying that? Yes. No, I imagine I... this computer too has the like the TOS Enterprise like. Bo computer voice. Yeah. Oh, it very much does. Yeah. yeah. The original Majel Baird. She didn't do. She didn't no, do she the did computer. The not in the TOS one. No. It's just a really like harsh computer female voice. Yeah. Oh. Error. 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 Yeah. It's very much like that. Compute yeah. inquiry. That is not correct. Yeah. Yeah. It does well, echo. If they're saying yeah. destroy, defend yourselves. Yeah. Okay. I shoot one. Okay. Do they say destroy? That's what he said. No, he was just mocking. He was like, no, they he look like said, that. Said this oh, yeah. okay. Well, then, yeah. Well, said, I'm, I'm, I'm opening fire. I'm tumbling behind and a computer. And they speak monitor. in the same voice that the computer does. Mm. Yeah. Almost yeah. like the computer speaks. Destroy. Yeah. Yeah. Destroy. <laughs> Had enough of you. Okay. Let's fire away. Um, I will spend a threat. And retain initiative. And I will spend another one. And I will go first this time. Through you, buddy. <laughs> okay. All right. So I will attack. I, I guess it would be you. Um, oh, hail. What'd I get? Seven, seven and a 15. Seven and a 15. Net 15. Ooh, he is enough. So it comes right in and it tries to stab you with its shocky. <laughs> so it's got a, it's got is a, it, it's it, got like a claw. Is yeah. it melee or is it just shooting? literally like leans in and it, it's going to be melee. And it, and it zots. And you see like sparks flying from it and it tries to spark you as it touches you. Okay. Uh, you I go. got two successes. Now you're okay. rolled. Defend yourselves. What is wrong with me today? Uh, one success. Okay. Uh, so I will get seven non lethal. Jesus Christ. <laughs> you're getting tased, tased with a cow cattle prod. Okay. <laughs> uh, actually. I'm going to use No Stranger to Violence. And what does that do? Uh, it, it's one of my values. I'm going to reroll the 19 to get 14. So that's two successes. That's a tie? Which is a tie. Yeah. I don't remember what happens on a tie. Nothing. 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 
So it goes into Zot you, yeah. and, and you kind of so dodge out of the way, and, and Zot like, so it's like, it's right. Oh, yeah, no, William she Shatner, I'm like, dun, 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 Yeah. Are you humming the music, too? Yeah. Varya starts, dun, 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 dun. She's singing her own theme music. Um, okay. Uh, and in one of your turns. Well, I was about to shoot Kick before we him. got interrupted, but uh, you seem to be busy, so... Uh, I'd like Kick. to, like, shoot it. It's <laughs> like... Like While from you're the holding hip. it, yeah, from like the, will that affect me? Uh, I don't know I what the say, game rules are. I would say with that, so here you're in melee right now. Oh, yeah, okay. you're in melee. So if so you want to do I that, melee. it would it would increase two complications. Okay. It's two complications and two increases the difficulty by one because he yeah. has three targets in reach. Yeah, cool. So I'm gonna melee it. Okay, I'm gonna I don't know try to throw the thing. <laughs> yeah, why not? you, you hear this from Zanny. <laughs> Kick its ass. <laughs> <laughs> Think of it like a triple. Yeah. Do we have any momentum? <laughs> no. Like Kick, no. Kick it like a triple. That's oh, cocked. God. The 19 so goes on the 19. Or on the 11. Um, 11. So one success and a complication. Okay, one success and a complication. Uh, so we'll get two successes. So it so will now zot you. That's like three twenties at roll. Because you didn't play D and D today, just spend them. Yeah, yeah, right. I got one, two, I three, never four, five, these five six, seven. Is it vicious? No. So it'd be so five. one, two, three, four, five. Yep. That's an injury. Which is enough for an injury. Um, but uh, so it she's is. Tough. It Little is. Tough that her injury is non-lethal. Um, it one less to resist it. It is trying to stun you. Uh, so it, you literally kind of feel like the <laughs> yeah 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 yeah. Um, My like short hair just goes like. Psst. Yeah, you swear to God that it was going ha 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 ha, ha the whole time, but it really wasn't. Um, someone else is next. So I, I got an injury. I'd like to resist that injury. What? Sorry. I got an injury. Oh, right? you know, it's non lethal. Oh. I'm. I was gonna shoot. Go for it. Well, shooting, you're not gonna hit. I'm not in combat. I'm not in You're in the room with us. Yeah. They're all within reach. That's negative. That's a three difficult. Oh, that's four difficulty with, ne- with 17. You said two meter round room. Yeah. Yeah, we're within short range, which is reach. Oh. Which is unfortunate. You can punch one, which is way better for you. <laughs> no, it's not. You, you, you're going to, because you're going to have to roll difficulty four and a complication of 17, 18, 19. You could punch one and get by it. Mm. I wonder. Because they came in from outside and jammed us in the room. Yeah. So we're trapped in the room. It's a problem. I was just I was reading that. It sucks. Yeah. It really sucks because I was like, twin faces. Let's do this. Put them down. Just grab a knife. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you have a knife. Everybody has a knife. That's Everybody a good, on those. You go to the fight. Okay, I'm gonna just bolt past them outside. Yeah, do it. Uh, where did my dice go? Oh no, that's not. Neither so of those are gonna work. How does assisting oh work? It's just combat. I know. I'm reading. Yeah. So like, how does assisting work? When you assisting? In combat, yeah. Uh. No. Well, so you can only you, you only can only assist one person. Nothing better than practical experience. Yeah. Right. So you I just have, otherwise, I have that, like that, an ability that's a whole, that triggers when I assist. Yeah. yeah you, can, you can assist once per round, no matter what. That's one success at least. Uh, the monitor just switched from. Um, Alien presence detected to purge in process. Okay. I only got one success. One pass. success. Uh, can I assist zero. him? No, I will busy. get. Well, I get to assist in combat. Yeah. Yeah. Ooh. Sure. So um, I'm just, just gonna like. The one that she had to I away. have the. He zapped me, and I'm gonna swing around and like put my body in between the two, and I get a success. So that's For, to two help him. So be two yeah. total. Okay, I got. Yeah. Sorry. I'm going to try and zot you as well. Yeah. I turned the computer off. Computer? You can turn it off. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Oh, God. Did I get that right? Two, four. Yeah. One, two, three, yeah. eight, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Um, and you're kind of stuck in the middle of them. Great. Well, no, you got two successes, so you still made it through. Yeah, I just got I to also, zap you as you go. Yeah, and then I just fall down. Yeah, outside. so you kind of like into the water. Into the water. Luckily, I've got my thing on. Yeah. 
The captain disappears. Actually, I should have made you all roll with higher difficulty because you actually probably all do have a complication for your seats for extra I'm difficulty. A, I'm not fighting. Um, okay, so I'm burning a determination. Yeah. Uh, using a crazy plan is better than no plan. Ooh, tell me more. Seeing if I can better in this because I'm used to crazy plans. <laughs> I do. Yeah. Uh, I am going to the computer and I am going to take all the security protocols and turn them off. <laughs> okay. So I got two successes for determination. Okay. Uh, so I'm going to tell you right now, there's an added difficulty for this one because it is... In combat? <laughs> well, you're in combat and this sucker's old. Yeah. So you're dealing with pre-warp tech. Okay. Or like verge warp tech, right? So it'd be like you going to a Constellation class starship and trying to like do yeah. stuff. Constitution well, class. I can't burn any, anything else because we got no momentum. No, but you could burn with determination. I already did. Oh, yeah. Okay. I'm not giving you threat <laughs> to kill our captain. I'm I'm in the water outside at this point. <gasps> Is that a critical with your four? Um, Do you have a focus that's four and under? Shipboard engineering systems? Yeah. So that gives me four successes. You're 18 as a success? I got the critical for determination. So I got a one automatically. So four successes. And a complication with that 18. Because you had yeah, we all at two. Um, okay. No, I, don't, I can't use determination again, I'm assuming. Yeah, no. Okay. Uh, okay, so it will take another round. Yeah. Uh, but you can do it. Oh, they have a control alt escape. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not escape. Control alt. Shift? Nope. Task manager. Control, Where's the task manager? <laughs> it's quite literally like control alt escape. <laughs> but I'm Let's hitting control alt delete. This is how it's done on computers. Alright, so my third one will attack you, Sofek. Yeah. Uh, no, actually, you're the one on it, so it's gonna push past you and you and will attack you. So you can roll for Via if you want. That will sure. be that'll be two. So he's actually attacking so uh, Gurkhan, Me. but he's yeah. pushing, pushing past, past so quick and Vaya to get yeah. to him. So I guess you would resist, but we'd each add an assist. There's only one assist I think allowed. Sure. So. Yeah. Yes. One. Um, daring and security is 15 for me, so two successes for me. So three total. So three total. So that's enough to reverse it. So you're gonna stab in with a with a. I don't have a knife. I'm fighting. No, up but you're computer. doing tech. So I'm gonna. Yeah, you got well, a tool. Got, what tool would you? I will have my hydro spanner. Yes. I'm gonna like, take his knee off. Yeah. So <laughs> you just turn stab into it with a hydro spanner. Security. Uh, two points of damage. All right. Ow. <laughs> um, Why was I programmed to feel pain? Your turn. Uh huh. Since Gurkhan is being attacked, I'm going to turn around to a different terminal and also attempt to... Nerf picks robot! <laughs> <laughs> Why would I'm going to program to, with nerves? <laughs> I'm going to attempt to program into the computer that we are not hostile life forms. Oh, cool. Okay. So same complications he had, right? So it's yep. older tech, so it's an increased difficulty. Um, yeah. I have computer expertise, so I get a free bonus dice. Okay. Ooh. Okay. Yeah. Just. And yeah. you guys are rolling really low today, aren't you? Uh, not well. I've been We're doing not fine. Well. No. <laughs> He's doing fine. But That's for when I climbed down a cliff and I fell, but I landed. That would be reason science, science, science too, as well. Yeah. Yeah. Reason yeah. science. Yeah, yeah. Because we chased, we managed to chase that ship down. Oh, you know what? I'm so sorry. I owed you that. Here you go. <laughs> so you could you could add a dice if you want to. You should have had that in the pool because you had four successes and it was three. Oh, that you need. Well, that's in the pool. You can do what you want with it. Ask the question: Why am I killing? Uh, yeah, I'll buy an extra dice to really. There you go. It. Um, so yeah, it's uh, reason science uh, for this. Yes. Uh, three successes then, because I have a focus in computers. Okay. There you go. But All then right. two complications because the extended range, right? Actually, this would be daring in science. To be honest with you. That's fine, it's still 36 seconds. Okay. The main thing is science. All right. Um, so, yeah, you, uh, it's, like I said, it's going to take a round. Yeah. So at the end of this round, as long as you two stay on task, yeah. you'll be able to, like, accomplish these things. Okay. Top of the round. What did uh, Vaya do? Oh, shit. What's Vaya doing? 
She'd be shooting something. Reviving the. She's going after the captain. Yeah. I'm, the captain I'm, a, I'm outside in the lake. She's she's uh she's gonna med pack you. Yeah, she's gonna she, dive out. She, she's gonna dive <laughs> out. Yeah. <laughs> Out. I've already used my. She's knee deep in water. I pulled up the pads with you guys. I can't. It's a bad idea. It's a idea. So she's gonna dive out. Um, we're gonna. I'm gonna roll low. Yeah, she just dives through and looks epic doing it. Tucks and rolls yeah, and then full on like then like, swan dives yeah, into yeah, the water. Yeah, yeah. Um, and uh, can I have that back, please? Yeah. And I'm gonna roll. Yeah. Med kit. Yeah. For her, yeah. Both she had like a 16. In it, medicine yeah. and Even a basic character would have so a So she'll activate her med kit for you. <laughs> Time. <laughs> yeah. You can't take it easy. Uh, you still have your complications, but... Uh, it's, it's two hypos break simultaneously. Yeah. You didn't have any 20s, did you? Super no. Okay. It's, it was just just adrenaline. Just wake up. <gasps> yeah. <laughs> Cold car. Okay. Um, at the top of the round, the robots are going to try again. Do, 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 okay. do, 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 do. Retaining, I'm stealing initiative. Okay. Are you gonna make me do another one? No, we can't because it's only the first round. Oh, okay. Yes. I still have to spend them, so. Okay, it will try and attack. Uh, well, the one that attacked you will try and attack you again. Damn it. Um, and I will. Oh. Yeah. Oh, is it? Oh, is I'm it? I have to do this so I can reroll. Actually, I have to spend two. Oh, oh, that was so close. Oh, that that way, so it's only one. 20. Yeah, uh, I am going to not burn anything. But who's it? Try to no. Uh, that's two. Yeah, two successes, and I'm going to take the same um, hydro spanner and jam it where the groin would be. Yeah. Back, you foul devil. <laughs> uh, one point, two points of damage. All right. Still poking my way at it. Okay. Uh, and you're still considered tasking. That was just a backtrack. reaction. Yeah. Reaction. Yeah. So, uh, just, who would like to take the next action? Uh, I mean, one of us. None of them is engaging me. So yeah. Want to want to carry on with your task? Yeah. Okay. Otherwise, if you fall, go you team will buzz for you. No, you're still being attacked. So more difficulty for you. You still woman, yeah, fair. Don't worry. If I if, I if you fail, then I'll like try. Uh, nope. <laughs> I think those robots love us. We can take a few uh, into our ship. Two successes. Two successes? Yes. Not enough. Damn, still take another round. Five but you didn't fail, so that's yeah. good too. Um, robot, right? Robot. Okay, robot. so uh, robot on you. Um, I will bend. Uh, I'm, out of I'm gonna take three. I enjoy the fact that I'm actually hitting you. Are you? And I will do two. And. Just two. Thank you. So this one threw a net at you. Yeah. Great. Oh man, this is a space zoo. Yeah. <laughs> um. Uh. Okay. So fitness and security is that's three successes. That overrules my two. So yeah. you want to kind of throw the net back? So I just like wrap, <laughs> I wrap the net around my leg. I, you know, I catch it yeah. and wrap it around my forearm and just bring him in and sock him one in the face if I can. Shake oh, yeah, okay, cool. Attack. So you like drag him in and yeah. then hit him as he's coming in? Yeah. Uh, do you yeah, why not? Do, you, oh, because, well, have, okay, it was a, a contest. You have a, right, you have a right, shank right. as well. Right. right. Oh, okay, <laughs> well, then I stab him in the face with the knife. So it's seven dice for the shank, and it's vicious one. Sorry, I don't make half. No, no, you're good. I don't make half. Ooh, that looks decent. So two, four, six. six seven. Total. Seven. seven. Do you get momentum seven for damage. contested challenges? Um, no, I don't. No, you just, you, it's just win. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's shooting, you, get, you can get momentum. Seven damage. Nice. Uh, this is the one that you hit before, so okay. it, like... Just knife to the eye. Yeah, so uh, it just kind of like... Uh, uh, you do get momentum because you can spend it on rerolls and bonus damage. Awesome. And then it drops. Right. In like a, a, you know what? In full TOS fashion, yeah. it falls apart as it drops. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, Orderly's constructed. Um, I will, after 
after my massive adrenaline shot, yeah. I stand up, run back in, and tackle the one that's tackling me. Yeah, okay. Just, <laughs> no idea what I'm doing. Double leg takedown. That's that's Double awesome. Leg the leg one that the one that's the one that's passing. You're passing. It's gonna take a hit at you as you go by. <laughs> oh. Nope. One. one. Are you gonna use your? I will defend. Action? Yeah, I that's also, two. Also. So you're gonna defend I'll, against that one? Yeah, I'm, I'm and, running against yeah, yeah, that okay, one. Okay. Somebody comes out. Like, right, yeah, nope. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay. May I have mine back? Uh, so you got one up on that one. Yeah. So you one just push momentum. it out of the way. Try and like knock it. No, over, I tack, or like actually... straight up tackle it. I... The one that attacked you. Or you're... Yeah, yeah. The, the, the one that attacked you. I switch. Oh, you I just. Spirits are I see him coming at me. I just straight change and shackle it to the ground. Um, what you it's security, you it's security, it's security, and you do get a momentum for the beating it by one. Yes, you do. So you can yes. use it on damage. Cool. And your momentum did you use it because it's just straight it's security, cool, right? Yeah, it's, it, and, it's, and it's not. Oh, well, that's one, two, three points of damage. Yeah, wow, that's the maximum point of damage. Well, actually, if you're all twos, but yeah, so you push it back into the wall, it's still standing, but. How am I getting seven then? It's my security. The security plus, plus the weapon itself is two. Oh, you have a dagger. Yeah, gotcha. And he uh, just tackled. Got it. Yeah. Um, which is kind of you're like, oh, God, get off. Um, so that's your turn, and I got one more, right? Mm -hmm. I got the one attacking you. So I uh, he already went. I, I did damage to it. Oh, the one that I you're attacking. Taser down the groin. Yeah, so I'm he'll, fighting him. He'll pull on like. Uh, you're like uh, I'm gonna impose. Um, <laughs> I'm going to impose difficulty. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Uh, increase the difficulty by one to attack him. All right. So I'm at 18, 19. Yeah. No, no, not the, not that. It's whatever. Sam oh, difficulty. 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 Ah. Yeah. So Sam in essence has a plus one. Captain Duck. <laughs> nice. Yes. <laughs> nice. Okay. Uh, so I can spend. I spent that. Sorry. Oh, you spent that. I one. spent yeah. the momentum to do that. But I can spend this. That one moment to die. Should I? So I have three at the moment. Cool. I have. Whew, that's technically three. I don't have hand to hand combat. I have plus hand phases. One. But three plus, plus the one, one. Plus he gets negative one. So yeah, you get the one and you win. So three dice. Yeah. You're, nice. you're straight punching a metal so wall. I had two, Sweet. Essentially. Sweep the leg! Yes! Uh, that's one. Okay. Oh, the leg's made of metal. <laughs> <laughs> the adrenaline, you forgot. Just like, every time we punch yeah. this uh, thing. I'm going to use a determination. <laughs> yes, I'm going to use technology off. should never be discarded. Because mm -hmm. I'm trying to save these robots from being murdered as well because they're kind of cool and I want one in our engineering department. <laughs> okay. And my veteran, he says, we can do it, but you don't know why. <laughs> okay. Uh, one. Oh, I actually get that. Yeah. i got to stop doing that. Uh, you don't get threat for determination. I have to give you the threat. Yeah. Yeah. I have to, I have to give up threat. And there's a special rule that as a Klingon, you can give threat and then reroll. Oh, I should have just given you threat when I did my thing. Yeah. I gotta remember to do that. Yeah, if you're do out of determination, you can give me threat. Yeah. Because if so I one, succeeded, two, the robot four successes. shut down. <laughs> four successes. Oh, wow. Uh, yeah, okay. You were trying to shut them down, right? Trying to shut down the entire security system. That's... That's where I set the number, so yeah. Yeah. System inoperable. That wasn't Wait, very no, nice. Sorry. Error. System inoperable. Error. 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 That wasn't very nice, computer. <laughs> Who taught you to lie? Was it Romulans? You okay? I'm fine. The hyperspray is still sticking out of your neck. <laughs> I'm gonna continue you, with fine. Thanks, Maya. <laughs> reprogramming it so it doesn't think we're hostile life forms, just in case. Oh, good, because as you start to keep typing, you hear mission compromised. What was your? Well, we know what your mission is. Shutdown initiated. Shutdown of what? And you hear, you literally hear the. <laughs> all the lights shut off. And you feel no more air circulation. Everyone has their helmets on. The yes. And it yes. starts to get your, your like your gauges are automatically cold. like it's getting colder. <laughs> Why don't you make a roll to see if you can succeed at this round? Maybe Gerkhart. You also feel like the kind of like whatever little grab was yeah. there. Would you like, like support? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Take a threat. <laughs> I'm gonna get an automatic. We have momentum. 
Okay. We do have a momentum as well. Oh sure, why not? Oh uh, yeah, let's uh I'm gonna re I'm gonna make this computer dance to my tune now. <laughs> Are you gonna ask Gurkhan for help? Yeah, Gurkhan's gonna help me as well, by the way, because he's free not being attacked by murder. No no, no this is robots. oh yeah, this is the next round. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Oh my god! Wow! So I give you what? two. Three, four, five, six. So there I, is a compli complication there. But there's that'd be awesome. So I got four. I got two. So six. Plus an additional two for the thread. Oh, so yeah. eight. So eight. Wow. Eight successes. Okay, and well, a complication. Here's all your momentum. That's all of it. Plus one more for asking oh, a question. <laughs> no, that's not for this. I know. That's, <laughs> that's what you get. Um, and uh, the complication is going to be... What would be a good complication for this? A computer thinks that we're one of them. Oh, right? I got one. Yeah, go ahead. So you're going to reboot it? Yeah. I programmed it to think that we're not threats. Um, you want, I'm going to say... I wonder if that's violating the private directive. What is Just it? Do it. <laughs> hey. I'm going to give you this to reprogram it into thinking we're... Uh, what was this, the species name? Vaharai? The Vaharai. Okay. Given that they're all dead, no, we have not violated the Prime Directive. Oh, good. All right. We think they're all dead. So it powers back That's up. Point. It powers back up, and uh, the AI itself. So the systems all boot. The automated systems do not. It looks like in your haste to reprogram, while well, you did it, you don't have any idea how to activate the AI. So essentially, it's dead. The AI is dead. Mm. But the systems are still online? Well, the systems are online. So it will need someone or something to man like actually operate stuff. Mm. It needs a crew. Yeah, no, basically no automation anymore. Is there a uh, communications? Can we figure that? Mm -hmm. Can we contact the Payette? Yeah. Very, very staticky. Cool. Uh, Payette here. <laughs> nice. <laughs> hey, Sarah. How's it going? Good to hear from you, sir. Yeah, well. Hey. Hey, Beagle. I'm supposed to say answer. Oh. <laughs> Sorry, Beagle. You seem busy, huh? I was commanding. I know. I'm making him really inept today. <laughs> Carry on. <laughs> I'll give him a brief report of what just happened with the murder bots and the weird plant things, but I think we need to get this station out of this orbit. So I'd like to order them to lock on a tractor beam, but we're also going to coordinate to see if we can get the ship engines to give it a push because we yeah. can't pull the whole thing. Yeah, they can. By you can you can aim the ship so the ship can go at like sub like it can go a little yeah. bit faster than full impulse free. So yeah, yeah, so you can aim it towards another area and get it out of it. Let's say with the help of the ship giving it like tugs every now and then. Yeah, yeah. Um, you can get the get the worker bees working too. Well, and you've been able to reprogram it so you can reset it for a new destination star, right? It's, it's orbiting this star for on purpose. Um, we'll be there in fifty thousand years. You hear Beagle, last uh, sir? Yes, Beagle. So you told us that it was about eighteen light years off course. Uh, yes, I believe that's so. Uh, long range sensors. We've detected similar um, signs of life to what you described in the area interesting well first things first we got to get it out of uh orbit around this red dwarf and out of the way of that supernova and then let's once we're back on the payette we'll have a look at uh where this place is and maybe okay. reach out see if they're post-warp ah so as you as you beam back carry on, quarantine, etc. You yeah. realize that this looks like where it is. That's where you were. That's the original star. Yeah. That's where he's pointing to. It's about 16 light years, 18 from where you are. Cool. Uh, so that would be the origin. No. Or the destination. Well, sorry, that's the, the original destination. destination right. is here. And you've detected a planetary system with life. Do they have space? Pre-war. Damn it. But... That would have made things easier. But you do detect high levels of tech. Hmm. We can give the uh, space station a push in the right direction, so it'll be detected. 
True, but we'd have to make sure that any of our uh, computer programming is wiped from the system before. Well, you kind of yeah. just reforced, like, it's like a control you know, delete reboot. Yeah, you know, hard reboot, right? Yeah. I basically just made it so when it scans our life size, it thinks that we're its yeah. owners. Yeah, so that will have to go. Okay. So but at this point, at this point we could, the doctor will yeah. inform you that unless they are notified, there's no way that the life forms will survive that distance. 18 light years is a long time on some light. Sorry, you mean the life forms in the mm -hmm. ship thing? So it'll arrive where you need it to with the programming for that ship, so that station, but without an automated system. Is there any way we could re-automate the system without it? We wouldn't have to instate a full AI, just something we already programmed. And then we could send out if a... plant dying fix. Well, then we can also use a communication array from the ship to send out a signal to those people where it's supposed to go, maybe to get them to pick it up earlier. We can give it a little faster nudge in the right direction, know what I'm saying? We could attempt to use their own communication array to send out... I could see if there is a some sort of distress beacon in their computer and fix it towards its destination, as well as simply making it seem like the AI degraded past the point of true sentience. That way we wouldn't be violating the Prime Directive. We would get the ship to where it's going. We'd gather some valuable intel. I'd say we call it a day. I mean, once we get a range of the... Yeah, yeah, we're going to say you've been doing that the whole we time. We can scan the entire we ship fairly quickly and know yeah. everything about it. And then, Captain, yes, we can always install a portion of an AI programming board and replicate the degradation. Just to keep everything alive. Thoughts? As long as... Our footprint is very small. Uh, yeah. Very small. We should be able to do this. Yes. Sounds like computer. And right you've noted that the Maharai are in a system that has very little life, so it might not be a bad idea to investigate them as well. Well, we can once we put it on the page, we can uh, do a little flyby, and we've got more than enough tech to make sure they don't detect us. Mm -hmm. So we could also see if we could do temporary uh, reinforcements and deflector install on the vessel and maybe take it low warp. So it gets there faster and then we have to take it all out? Is that viable? Uh, anything's viable if I put enough Klingon into it. <laughs> so I'm going to go know what? Hold no. on, hold on, hold on. <laughs> As you say that, that's actually where we're going to end tonight. Mm -hmm. That's the end. <laughs> we, will, we will see when you put enough Klingon into it. That's just... Yep. I mean, that's what you get. Uh, we'll see you next week. Have a good night, everyone. Bye. Good night. Good night.